I once saw a great interview with uh, Carol Burnett on Inside the Actor's Studio, and she was asked, what is your least favorite word? And she said, responded very quickly, can't. And that's a word that catches up a lot of us, and maybe it's a word in your vocabulary. So go ahead and think of something that you'd like to do. You know, whether it's calling someone to ask them out on a date, or some athletic endeavor, or some business endeavor, making some phone call, making, uh, losing a certain amount of weight, uh, staying sober from a particular drug or other kind of addiction, um, whatever it might be, something that you wish you could do in life but you doubt. So take a moment, close your eyes, take a deep breath. Think about this thing that you'd like to do and say, I can do it. Rate that on a scale of 0 to 10. Just be aware of what thoughts and feelings come up, what reasons might be there as to why you can't. Just notice how much doubt is there. Notice what feelings you have in your body around that. And when you're ready and uh, willing to take full responsibility for your own well-being, let's tap. Even though I doubt I can do it, I choose to love and accept myself anyway. Even though I doubt I can do it, I choose to love and honor myself anyway. Even though I doubt I can do it, and I've got all sorts of evidence to prove that I can't do it, Even though I doubt I can do it, I choose to deeply and completely love, honor, and accept myself and anyone else who may have contributed to this doubt. This doubt that I can do it. All this doubt that I can do it. There's something that I wish I could do. Something that would really benefit me to do. But I don't think I can do it. And I'm not going to try until I'm sure I can do it. But I won't be sure I can do it until I do do it. And so I'm stuck. But I don't want to let this go. I don't want to give up on myself. But sometimes I do. And sometimes I have. And I'm letting go of that. Clearing all the past pain. Of all the times I've given up on myself. clearing all the past pain of all the times I tried but failed. Because part of me knows there's no such thing as failure. There's only feedback. And past performance is not proof of what's possible. Because there are so many things that I do today that I couldn't do at some point in the past.
In fact, most of what I do these days I wasn't able to do at some point. But I learned to do them. I have great capabilities within me. I don't yet know what I can't do. I only know what I haven't been able to do so far. And sometimes I couldn't do it. Simply because I was unwilling to. And I'm removing those blocks. I'm removing those fears. All this fear that I can't do it. All this fear of trying and failing. It's worth the risk. I'm clearing those blocks. And clearing all of this self-doubt. Deep inside, I know that I am capable of far more than I know yet so far. Chances are, I've barely scratched the surface of what I can do. Sometimes I see other people doing things that I wish I could do. And I say, ah, that's not me. They've got something I haven't got. Maybe all that they've got that I haven't got was the willingness to give it a try. I'm capable of far more than I know. And I choose to find out how far I can go. I'm clearing the blocks. Clearing the resistance. Clearing all my old doubts. And other people's doubts too. Maybe someone told me I couldn't do it. How do they know? Who made them an authority on what I can do? Maybe they're just expressing their doubts about what they can do. and their fear of having me do it. Because that might make them look bad. They have more capability too. And I'm not going to hold myself back.
so that they can be comfortable in their insecurities. And I don't need to make myself comfortable in my insecurities. Because the fact is, I am more amazing than I know. And I choose to find out how amazing I am. And chances are, no matter how far I go, there will still be more ability there will there will always be more where that came from i don't know that i can't do it so i'm clearing this doubt Clearing it at a cellular level. Clearing it all the way back through my past. I may not have done it yet. But I can do it. I can do it. And I choose to know this in body, mind, and spirit. And take a deep breath. Go get yourself a drink of water and go out and find what you can do. Because there's something that there's a lot of things that you have inside of you, things that'll make a positive difference in the world. And stop holding yourself back and uh, withholding. Stop, uh, stop pulling out on us, okay? So, thank you for going out and doing what you can do.